Now we got our dowels cut in half. We can join them together. Just need a, a somewhat okay fit. This glue is geared. Okay, so now clamp that one on there. All right, let that cure. Okay, glue is cured. So now got to trim the front. Okay, so I, I trimmed them up. I took a little more off the front here. Not sure how much material I need up here, so I'd rather have more than not enough. But what I'd like to do is add a little extra right here for this transfer part. So I'm going to attempt this with clay. I'm going to make a negative of this section so I can set this into it and see how much I need to add. So I'll lay this in here and I can measure the distance from here to here. Here's the core. This is the intake side of it. So I built all that up. Next is to pull the plaster mold from both of these pieces. Put in some grease on this so the plaster doesn't stick to the wood. It's now I got a little bit of glue. Put a little grease on this wood as well. Put a weight on here just because this clamp is heavy over here. Alright, so I mixed up my plaster. Could have used a smaller container. Okay, I'll let that set up for an hour or so. Okay, this is about one hour later, and it is pretty set up. Let's see if this is going to be a struggle. Hmm. The fun part is getting that thing out of there. That wasn't bad. Nice. Okay, this half is cleaned up. Got all the grease out of it. I drilled registration marks. Screwed the patterns together. Chose not to glue them. I'd like to get them back apart. I modified the box to fit just on top of that one. I shrunk it in size just a little bit. I'll grease around the bottom edges so nothing oozes out. Okay, it's been about two hours. Alright, I cleaned up some of the mess. I'm going to try to get this to split. Hopefully it's a success. Just going to get this one out of here. So it's all cleaned up. Got all the grease off it. It just worked out really good. I'm happy with it. And they fit together really nice. and tight doesn't slide should I put some sand in it and see if it's gonna work let's do that now the this this deep section the port section I'm gonna pack a little sand in there first gonna work or not so this is just green sand hoping to just get away with using green sand put that one back on oh there we go Oh, I like this. So what I'll do is I'll real lightly just brush it before I put it in the mold to get rid of the little parting line. I guess it's time to cast the engine block.